morning welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new here i would love to have you so today is friday is december 2 which i still can't believe we are already on december and it is 11 20 so we still have a few errands to run today i want to go to home goods something is telling me to go and i don't know what it is but when I had that gut feeling, I had to go. And normally when I go, I always find something. I'm not looking for anything, to be honest. I'm pretty okay with my furniture pieces, my decor. Even for Christmas, you guys know all the hauls that I did. I had plenty, plenty Christmas decor. I still have literally bags here that I had to go through and see what else I need to put out because it's too much. But um, I was just editing the video and it's already up is um, my master bedroom tour if you guys haven't seen that video I would definitely get down below for you guys so excited how my bedroom turned out like I've been spending the whole morning here like literally it's, it feels so cozy and so magical I just love it it's my very first time putting Christmas in my bedroom and it feels so good so if you are indecided and if you have the space for it go ahead and do it I had the ring light on because even though the sun is out, it's not too like crazy out, <laughs> if that makes sense. We bought these burgers and I'm so excited to do this. I know here in the apartment complex we have a grill, but I'm a little bit skeptical. I know people use it, but like, I don't know. I'd rather have my own grill and we don't really have like the space for it because we live in apartments, but yes we're gonna do this burger and we have all the ingredients we only missing what i just told you guys but i had to delete some footage because i'm literally in zero minutes look my shirt it says perico yes perico proud <laughs> but anyways y'all i have my christmas here i was getting my Goya coconut water. I'm obsessed with coconut water. Like, you guys don't have no idea. But everything is pretty much clean. Are you okay? Look at you. <laughs> but anyways, I was just looking for apartments. You guys know my lease is ending next year around, I would say probably like April. I'm not sure how to go back, but um, we are looking for apartments. You guys know that apartments go up every year. And even though we like this apartment, I don't think it's totally worth it because it's going to go over too much because that's how it is. So I know I received this question one time in my Facebook Um what I was saying, like, oh, my God, I'm moving. I had this new apartment and somebody... I don't think she got offended, but like she took it very personal. She was legit telling me like, why you move so much? Like, and I mean, keep in mind this person lived with her parents and she don't really have her own place. So of course, like she don't really understand, I guess, how things work. Because if it's for me, I would love to stay for a good minute in a place, like maybe a few years. And that's what we are working on to get a house. I mean, right now it's really hard to get a house. We're working on our credit score. And we also trying to save money before we even do that investment. And also we want to make sure we want to stay here because we talk about it. We talk about we want to probably get a house even outside of the states so we're not really sure what we're gonna do we're pretty young too and we're just trying to figure things out but if you had that question as well that's the reason why i mean the lease go up every time and if you guys know me for a good minute now i always had bigger apartments all my apartments were like two bedrooms two bathroom townhome style and I mean, that's the reason why right now I'm literally paying over $100 every month for a storage unit just to get those extra stuff that I used to have in my second bedroom and combine everything together is almost like a whole rent. Yeah, we're gonna go to the leasing office and we're gonna talk to her. Uh, we wanna see, we love this community. Like, we don't have no issues with nobody. The neighbors are great. There's a lot of old people too, so you don't really get a lot of noise or like hype music. 
it's pretty pretty chill and I love it and it's very standard too like Hattie Cedar is here Target like I'm literally so center with all you know the stores that I like and I love that so I definitely want to stay in the area and we would love to stay in this community so we're gonna talk to her I just want to see the two bedroom apartments and see how they look inside see the sides and you know if it's worth it so the only thing that I want to do is work on the kitchen right now it's a mess I had to do some dishes and stuff like that but I haven't decorated the kitchen yet I think that's gonna be like the last thing I'm gonna do which actually is the only area that I had to decor because the living room is done my bar area is done and now my bedroom as well so I only missing the kitchen and I forgot to show you guys in better lighting how this looks because and it was awful like my last vlog it was really hard to see so let me move this out of the way okay so you guys know that I got this beautiful vessel from heart and hand from Target it's sold out like insanely sold out I was lucky enough to find these two it was in different locations but I was able to get it and I'm just literally obsessed like it's so so pretty it goes perfect and you guys know I wasn't feeling too much the branches from um, Kirkland's but now I like it it looks so pretty I think it was the vase the tall vase it was competing too much with the garland and it was like too much I just love how it looks like I just wanted to show you guys that because I know when I recorded it was like so freaking dark and I couldn't really show you everything but it looks so pretty all right guys it's almost 12 o'clock and i'm literally starving my boyfriend just came back from the grocery store he had this bread it looks so good he also got the cookies oh my god we're gonna do some cookies later so excited for it because i love doing cookies and we have oh he got the organic which is okay um the pickles for the burgers i mean he doesn't really like pickles but i love pickles in my burgers and he also had the tomatoes these are the prettiest tomatoes ever like look at this it's so cute and fresh i love that so that's exactly what i needed
20 and a few things I want to show you guys so first of all let me start with the good news because of course I'm so excited we are moving out yes here is um, the um, what do you call the transfer agreement so I decided to stay in this community because it's pretty quiet I love it we don't have these issues with like roaches and stuff like that it's very clean and I have a good relationship with the landlord so I just went today and we literally just left the office right now because we was just doing the whole the paperwork so we are upgrading for a two bedrooms and I think it's two bathroom apartment and it's also is deluxe so it have like a whole private patio which I'm obsessed with that because it's great for mats you guys know I have a big um, dog and that's the main reason why I really want to move since I got this apartment and I'm so excited because the patio is private and I would love to have furniture there but at the same time I don't mind to just leave it like that and call it a day just because Matt is a big dog and that patio is gonna be perfect for him to you know lay down and just be in his own space so super excited for that you guys like so um we are moving it's supposed to be in March but she said the apartment will be ready probably in next month so she asked me if it's okay if I want to move out like earlier even though she technically not supposed to do that but I mean like I said I've been paying on time I've been a good resident and um, I don't know but she was like I mean the apartment gonna be ready next month so if you're ready to move at that time I can make it for you and I was like that's perfect <laughs> so um, yeah I definitely gonna drop the apartment tour here in the new apartment tour <laughs> I cannot believe I'm moving again I'm so so excited because like I said I always live in big apartments and I haven't seen it yet I just saw the outside and I saw the private patio it also is still close to the park here where I always um, take mats out so yeah we're just so so excited for it so that's the first news that i wanted to share with you guys and i just cannot wait i'm just thinking here about the whole packing thing which i shouldn't be packing that much because like i said we're just transferring in the same community so i think it's gonna be really easy even though we still gonna have to rent a u-haul um yeah we still can do a few trips and it's gonna be fine so we don't really have like big big furniture like that. I'm so excited. I, I'm literally trying to process everything. So um, yeah, just stay tuned for a moving vlog because I know things are gonna look different. I'm gonna have two bedrooms, two bathrooms, and private patio, and it's gonna be more bigger. So I'm pretty sure it's gonna be more space for decor. The furniture is not gonna look too cluttered, in my opinion. Like I said, I haven't seen the apartment inside, but she said like this one is like with more square fit, which of course I believe it. And uh, it's big, as she says, new flooring. They are just working on the cabinets. So yes, y'all, I'm literally excited anyways that's the exciting part of this video and now i want to show you guys what i got from home goods so i went to home goods and i wasn't looking for anything but something told me this morning you had to go girl you just had to go and every time i had that feeling i always find something that i was looking for or i wanted to so let me start with the first thing that i got from home goods i saw these book many times and for whatever reason i never pick it up because i don't really care about any about chanel and stuff like that but it's all about the aesthetic okay it's all about the aesthetic i was thinking to use this in my bedroom actually and it's the chanel it looks like this and it's only thirty dollars here's the price yes i have the ring light right now because even though it's only 525 it's so dark outside you guys know like it's getting dark early so yes y'all i'm literally obsessed i like this part right here super modern 
and minimal. Oh, can you focus, please? Hopefully, okay. So yeah, it's Chanel, and like I said, I was just kind of like gravitating towards this um, book. I don't think I'm really going to look what is inside. Like I don't really care about fashion like that. I just like a nice coffee table book, and this is giving. So the size is perfect. Okay, so from Home Goods, I got these beautiful bells, and I know I don't need no more bells. I'm okay, but these ones are. I guess these type of bells that you just can't set up in somewhere and I was planning to put some in my coffee table. So it's these beautiful bells, you guys. They are only $7.99, I believe. Where's the tag? I lost that one. Oh, it fell. <laughs> I'll come here. It fell, but it's $7.99. Such a sale. And they only have three left, so of course. I got the three because why not it's so so pretty it's this beautiful kind of like vintage looking brass color and I got three of them and like I said you can kind of like pair them all together but I'm planning to just put them in somewhere just like this and I think it's gonna look so so pretty for only eight dollars are you kidding me like it's so so pretty and they're pretty big as well the quality is amazing and I wasn't expecting this especially right now that we are we are on December like a lot of things sold out so when I went to home goods I'm very impressed that home goods have a lot of Christmas decor like a lot I'm pretty sure if I go to Target maybe I'm not gonna find anything but I don't need anything from Target. You guys know I got crazy this year. And the other thing that I want to show you guys is from Ross. So I normally don't buy clothes like that. But this year, I've been trying to really dress up nice. And I just want to look more feminine. Because sometimes, y'all, I just put this up and I just go out. And there's nothing wrong with that. But, like, I was thinking, like, when I was more younger, I used to really, like, dress up, have my makeup. But I've always been on top. And it makes me feel very confident, very good. And then since I started working on Thorship, I just get so tired. And it's just, I think it's the schedule, to be honest. Like, I just don't feel inspired to do anything else. But that's gonna change because I'm not playing. So I got these beautiful clothes. This is from Ross. I only pay 20 $1.99 y'all this is absolutely gorgeous let me show you <sighs> look at this so so pretty you guys know I'm obsessed with this type of clothing really nice and like beige or ivory color love this kind of like leather but super super nice because this material is more deep than this one and it looks so good like oh my gosh and it's so soft i'm literally obsessed with the whole thing so i cannot wait to use this um very very soon actually anyways my head is pounding my boyfriend just gave me this yummy i say ice cream but it's actually i don't know how he called this thing but it's so good um so i'm just gonna enjoy this put everything away and I'll see you guys in my next vlog. Bye.